Well, whether you travel for business or for pleasure, your trip to California is about to get easier. For a lot of people, this is a big deal. This spring, Delta Airlines announced it will add nonstop service from Spokane to LAX. And the inaugural flight is this morning. Casey Lund is checking things out at the airport. And Casey, that flight leaves at uh, about nine minutes, right? Yes, they are boarding, Derek. And before they board, they got the royal treatment from uh, GEG here. They got a red carpet, uh, photos taken, kind of getting that uh, L.A. feel laid back. The flight leaves at 6.45, it lands in Los Angeles at uh, 9.50. Then uh, the return flight this evening will leave at uh, 7.25 and get back here in Spokane, or excuse me, 9 it's 7.25, get back here in Spokane at 10.50, uh, just in time to tuck the kids into bed. And we talked to business travelers who say this is a whole day of traveling. So they got the, uh, again, red carpet treatment. They got massages, food, uh, a big deal here at the Spokane International Airport. Uh, I talked to a lot of folks. They paid around $200 one way, about $400 for a round trip ticket. And again, it's just going to cut a whole travel day in half. So a very big announcement. And uh, those folks boarding that flight, uh, even though it's beautiful, here in Spokane. They're very, very happy to be landing in uh, Los Angeles this morning. And again, they will have the opportunity. You can travel to LA, have a business meeting, and come back uh, at the end of the night. So really cuts down a lot of travel time. And uh, Mayor Condon, uh, Senator Cantwell, when they first announced this said, they think this is going to be a 20% boost to the tourism industry here in Spokane. Folks coming here to see Schweitzer and uh, all the great things that we have here in the Pacific Northwest, as well as our folks going out to LA for Disneyland, uh, Magic Mountain, and all those great things out in California. Those folks aboard that flight, uh, it's very full, and the next few flights are also full. So you're going to want to book those flights if that's something that you're interested in. And again, I got a little taste of what those folks got to see. I got a massage, got a little breakfast and some coffee. Very fun stuff and a great announcement and a big thing for us here in Spokane.